Hey everyone, this is my birthday book haul. So September is my birthday month and instead of anything else, I asked my friends and family to gift me books instead because I am in the process of rebuilding my physical book library. You know, some of these are gifts, but some of them are also books that I purchased myself. So let's start with this first stack. This first stack right here is what I call my book trophies. These are books I have already owned, have reread, loved, adored, obsessed over, and I want a physical copy so I can display it on my shelves and also reread and annotate because I've started getting into annotating lately. Um, and I would love to do, and I'd love to start doing that with the books I already love. One of the places I wanted to go to on my birthday weekend was an indie bookstore up in Scottsdale, Arizona called The Poison Pen. And when I got there, I found these signed copies of Sarah Kate's books. I have been a longtime fan. I've actually read this whole series. This is the Salacious Players Club series. And what I found, let me show you guys, I found more than one book that have been signed by Sarah Kate. I am so excited. So I found Madam. Um, give me more as well as the highest bidder I don't think I've read this one yet so I'm really really excited again I believe this is a signed copy yeah so this has been signed I did pick up two books uh, praise which is the first book of the series and eyes on me which is my favorite one of the series neither of these are signed but what I did find out is that she is planning on going back to the poison pen in December uh, and doing a signing event so I purchased those and plan on getting them signed then. This next set of books is actually a trilogy. I have already read it and again, read it multiple times. It is a trilogy by Angel Lawson and Sam Rue. And this is the Lord series. I'm not really sure if that's what the series is called now that I, <laughs> now that I think about it, but this is the Lord of Lords of Pain, Lords of Wrath, and Lords of Mercy. And basically, if you like the Lord series, you will find this very similar. The biggest difference, this is a Y choose. So there are multiple male partners and one FMC. And it is actually a set of three trilogies. So the next one is the Dukes, and the last one they've published and have completed are the Princes. And the last two books on my book trophy list, again, books I've already read, is the Predator from Runix. I cannot believe I actually found this at the Barnes & Noble shelf, the dark romance section at our local Barnes & Noble. I was completely surprised that they had it in stock. I've already read, this is part of the Dark Verse series by Runix. Absolutely love it. Tristan Kane and Morana Vitalo love them as a couple looking forward to the last book i believe it's called the syndicator coming out in october and the last book on the book trophy is the den of vipers by k.a knight this is again a why choose romance i read it a long time ago time for a reread but i was able to find this hard copy hardback copy at barnes and noble i could not believe it that they had it in stock so i went ahead and picked it up because absolutely love this book now the second stack of books here are books i have not read yet they are going to be added to my tbr for october most of them are kind of spooky witchy vampire vibes perfect for the spooky season um this first two are not spooky this is the losers um from harley larue this is the prequel called the dare this is actually a two-part series i haven't received the second one yet it's in the mail I, I ended up buying it from amazon because i couldn't find a physical copy next one is the bride from ali hazelwood i believe this is a paranormal vampire and werewolf love story other than that i have no i have no other idea what it's about but again perfect for spooky season the next book is Hunt Me Darling by Marie Rose. I, I think it's Mari, Marie. Marie? I'm not sure. I'm so sorry if I mispronounced it. But this is a dark romance. I believe it's a stalker. Catch me if you can. And last but definitely not least is The Cursed by Harper Woods. Harper L. Woods. I purchased the first one called The Coven. I have not read that yet because I do plan on reading them um, one after the other. It is part of a series. I'm not sure if it's a duet or a series, but I do plan on reading the books one after the other. That way, if it ends in a cliffhanger, I'm not left hanging for too, too long. Too, too long. But again, part of the allure of this book it is absolutely gorgeous look at this look at the sprayed edges on this one it is just I, I i am a sucker for a beautiful book 
All right, guys, so that does it for my birthday book haul. Have you read any of these books? If so, let me know in the comments what you liked about it. No spoilers, please, but let me know what you loved about these books and if any of them are on your TBR to be read list. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!